What up, FBF Squad? It's me, Jacquez, aka Fat Belly Fella, and I'm back. Before we get started, if you are new, do not forget to hit that subscribe button and tap that notification bell to be notified each and every single time I upload another video. And don't forget to leave a comment down below so I know you're here and I can say what's good. Hi. What's up, you guys? Listen, today we are having a whole, whole, whole bunch of snow crab. And we got some corn on the cob. We got a chipotle bowl eggs. We got so much, y'all. We got so much to catch up on. I wanted to talk to you guys about a little bit of something today, but... For the most part, we're going to enjoy this seafood, chit-chat, chill out. You know the vibes, y'all, so we're not going to waste more time. We're going to say our prayers, and we're going to get into this food. Amen. And we also have the coldest water bottle. You guys, if you would like a cold, coldest water bottle, go down to the link in the description box below. If you like 10% off on your saving, use my code Jacquez, okay? Period. And then you get you one with the 10% off. Okay, so y'all, I'm ready. I'm ready. I'm ready. But first, how you guys doing today? How you doing today? How you doing today? I hope wonderful. Y'all, y'all got me nervous. I'm sweating up in this joint. I already know what y'all saying. I already know what y'all saying. I already know. It's all good, baby. Give me one second. Oh, that's good. Y'all did these, um, I did these completely different from what I'm accustomed to, and they taste marvelous, darling. Marvelous. Whew. I miss you guys. <laughs> y'all miss me. I know y'all sick of my mess, but I did what I did for a reason, because, mm. I got my sauce in the back, back here. Um, yeah, let's eat first. Let's eat first. Ugh. Yes, ma'am. Yes, sir. Dang. I season these so good, I might not even need the sauce. I'm going. Savage on this joint. Man, listen. Oh. So bomb. I'm in heaven. I'm in heaven. Oh. 
you guys. So as you all know, I went on a little vacay, a little getaway to the Noya. To the Noya, baby. And it was nothing short of amazing. I really enjoyed myself. I really, really enjoyed myself. Even though we are going through some things as a country. And, you know, we just don't have the privilege of having certain privileges. You know, with the bars and things like that. Still had a fab time. Period. I went with some friends. <clears throat> for a couple of friends' birthday. And I really wanted to talk to you more so about traveling during the pandemic because I know a lot of people were just so disappointed that I was traveling during the pandemic. I ain't gonna say so many people. But it was more than enough people that, that was worried that shouldn't have been. Like, I appreciate you, Arian. I appreciate your concern. But you got uh, you got to learn how to let adults be adults and make their own decisions. As long as they're being safe, I'm not being... You know me. And if you don't know me, you need to know me. <laughs> At least before you make assumptions about my character and the things that I do or whatever. Y'all get what I'm saying. I'm so focused on this seafood. So I purposely stayed away for approximately almost I think it was, this would be the 14th day just to show you guys that although we are going through what we're going through and all those things and people are terrified but I just don't want people to be as terrified you know I just still want people to be able to live and enjoy themselves because I mean it's no it's no need to sit and dwindle and all of the craziness that's going on. Yes, we are very freaking aware of what is going on, but at the same time we still have to live, you guys. We cannot be living in no fear. Chipotle bowl egg. We can't live in fear. Especially not me. Y'all, I haven't been out of Illinois for the past, I would say a good six years. I could not. I needed that vacation. And it was unfortunate. You know, the circumstances were unfortunate. But I needed it. So I went. And had a damn good time. Ooh. Oh, God. I wish I could tell y'all the stories. Ooh. But that same that rule that apply in Vegas, whatever stays in Vegas, I mean, whatever happens in Vegas, y'all know the rest. Um,
Man, listen. What you're not going to do. Baby. <laughs> mm, it's been a minute. <laughs> it's been a minute. Oh. Get your coldest water bottle link in the description box. want y'all I want y'all to enjoy your lives man I preach about that all the time and you know I preach being safety you know putting safety procedures that are in place first put those things in place first and you good I purposely stay away for 14 days to show you guys that I'm good I have no symptoms yes Chicago weather caught me up when you know they, they really caught me lacking real quick because I was still dressed like I was in the New Orleans weather and the New Orleans weather was just giving me everything that I needed. You know, I got back to Chicago it was a little it was a little sketchy. <clears throat> it was a little sketchy when I got back. Ooh. But I require I you know, I got through that real quick. It wasn't nothing. Mmm. Mmm. The weather trying to get you. <clears throat> but what I was irritated at? Hold on, I gotta finish this leg first. I listen, I got to talk about it. Oh, I got to talk about it. Because Delta, Miss Thing, y'all got me messed up. myself like this. No white t-shirt and no dang on seafood boy. Boy, what's wrong with you? What's wrong with you? What you think you professional or something? Is that what it is? I forgot about you. Mm. Mm. Oh, please believe me. I ain't forgot, boo. Bro. So, you know me. I'm, I'm, I'm very punctual. I like to be ahead of time. Especially as it pertains to traveling. Because I just don't want to be caught up in anything. But I got caught up. <laughs> Against my own will, at that. Y'all know me, I'm a big old baby. When things don't go my way, but it's all good because I always get my results at the end of the day, and that's on period. <laughs> that's on period. Sometimes you just gotta go there. Uh uh. Got to the airport. 
way ahead of time because I was just ready to get home. You know, even though I enjoyed myself on the trip, you know, sometimes you just get home so you just want to be in your own bed and, you know, be able to, you know, cavage you and all those things the way you want. And, um, got to the airport on time, like, early, early. Got there, it was completely, it was empty, which I was fine with that. I was like, okay, you know, it was empty, it wasn't too many people around, I was fine with that. But, my flight had a layover in Atlanta, and, no, let me take it back. I had this app with the, the, you know, the Delta app or whatever, and they tell you about your flight and all that, you know, where your, your flight is and all that, blah, 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 and I was just happened to look at the thing, and it said that my flight had been delayed, you know, you know, and it gave me the option to decide on whether I wanted to take a little bit of a later flight or keep the current one that I had, so I was just like, well, if y'all giving me the option to change my flight, and go somewhere, you know, take another flight that's going to be more convenient for me, then I'm going to take that other flight that's more convenient for me because I'm ready to go home. I'm ready to get <laughs> ASAP. Mm. So, there was a bit of a delay. I was like, okay, fine, whatever. So, I get to my, my layover in Atlanta and not only did it have my Gate number screwed up. I had to go run it back and forth, you know. In the airports, they had the A and the B section. The B section is downstairs, and you had to go take the little train thing and all that stuff to get to that place. Well, the train wasn't available, so I had to walk. Okay, so that was already strike one for me. Strike two game, when I finally made it to the gate, and they changed it to the A section. So I had to not only... <laughs> go walk all the way back down that way towards the train but the train still was not available to take me back to the second I'm just like listen this cannot be my reality right now and at this point the airport is crowded Ooh. I don't know where all these people came from tomorrow yeah tomorrow. But I just wanted them to, to just go away. <laughs> I don't know. That was just my mind. I just wanted everybody to just go away for that moment. It was a little scary. It was almost it almost gave you like an underground like kind of vibe. Like, oh my God, these people aren't supposed to be out or something like that. Mm. It was like some kind of secret society or something like that. The people that was traveling in <laughs> I was like, it just feels so weird. I don't know. But, um, so yeah, I get back to the gate that I'm supposed to be. After pumping it through the dang old airport because I'm assuming that my, my flight is going to be on time. And it wasn't, and it was delayed, and you want to know how long it was delayed for? <laughs> Do you really want to know? Because y'all probably going to be pissed for me. Five hours. <laughs> yeah, girl, five hours. Five hours. In a pandemic. I personally feel like with everything that's going on right now, there should always be a plan B, a plan C, plan D, E, F, G, if you have to. I don't think it's ever appropriate for these people to be sitting around in such a space like this with so many people out, you know, there should always be some kind of other plan. If the plan is delayed, plane is delayed, then you need to find some another plane out here. It's not asking for too much because I mean, if y'all want to, if y'all want to, y'all want people to adhere to you guys' rules and all those things, you have to. I mean, at least make it something, you know. 
make it convenient for your customers. <clears throat> I did not feel at ease sitting in that airport for five hours. I was supposed to make it home. Well, I kid you not. I was supposed to make it home by four in the, in the evening, right? The mail. Somebody got packages. We ordered so much stuff, I don't even know what the hell I ordered. Anyway, girl, I see you coming, Miss Thing. You need to stay over there if I kill you, because I already tried to get you. Girl, ain't nobody invite you to dinner. I don't understand why you hovering. <laughs> Got my friend Susie. She's just flying around, girl. I just don't understand. Him. So, um, yes, yeah, so I was supposed to make it home around four and four in the in the um in the evening, and I made it home at two in the morning. My flight didn't get there until twelve. I didn't make it home until two. Who? Do y'all think y'all playing with? Delta. I want parts of that company. <laughs> I want parts of that company because I just don't think. <gasps> oh, excuse me. We got so many snow crabs to go through, and I want to go through all of them, so this might be a little lengthy. <laughs> this video might be a little lengthy, you guys, because I want all of this. Mm. It's okay, I got time. Y'all influence me. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. Yeah, I was really, I was. I ain't even gonna hold y'all. I was really upset about that. I was really upset about that. And <sighs> as much as I wanted to get on people that work their hell, I slightly I did a little bit. I did a little bit. I did a little bit. I did do a little bit. But it wasn't to, I just wanted them to know that I was really dissatisfied with what was going on. Because, baby, ain't no reason for me to be still sitting in this airport five hours. No, 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 no. Mm -mm. Get me home. But I know better next time. Pissing me off. Mm. Man, I miss these eggs so bad. My best friend is now eating these things like they chips, apparently. <gasps> oh. 
Oh, I gotta put this shirt in the washer as soon as I'm done. I love this shirt. Why did I do this? Why did I do this? <laughs> no. No. Oh, it's not bad, but it's still bad. Ugh. Now I feel like I need to put like a paper towel or something in my shirt. <sighs> Jeez Louise, I just can't double be great. You just refuse to let me be great. That's okay. We'll fix this. We'll fix this real quick. Good thing y'all can't see that much. <laughs> Good man. <clears throat> no, 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 come on. Ah. But by all means, you guys, live. If you feel like traveling, travel. Just in moderation. <laughs> don't don't make it a, a habit, you know. In moderation and be safe. Be safe. I mean, you might as well, because ain't no telling when everything's going to go back to 100% normal, if ever. And that's just being real. That's just being real. So you might as well start adjusting and learn how to maneuver through all of this, this madness, you know, as far as the pandemic is concerned. I ain't doing nothing with that. <laughs> as far as, you know, Miss Thing is concerned. <laughs> Miss Thing, Miss Thing on the sign. Causing all this ruckus. Huh. <laughs> Y'all know her name. I am in heaven. In heaven. I need this meat up out of here. Ooh. Girl, you better get up out of here. Jeez. Mmm. Mo. Oh, she's getting aggressive. <laughs> oh, she's getting aggressive. Mmm. Miss Thing, you, you better know what's good for you. You better tread lightly. Home girl, you better tread lightly. Tell her. She knows what's good for her. Because either I got them hands or I got that swat. What you want?
one thing I'm going to tell you about it, though. I'm not going to play with you about my food. I'm sitting here going off on this fly. I'm for real, though. Girl, you're going to get killed messing with me. You know where I'm from? Too soon, too soon, too soon, too soon. Mm. 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 <clears throat> yeah, I feel like I ain't even put a dent up in this thing. I know I'm buying it. I know I'm bad at him. I ain't put a dent up in this thing. Mm. <laughs> oh, that was my best friend. So I eat corn like a typewriter. Y'all remember him saying that mess? Girl, bye. Girl, goodbye. short because I know y'all don't want to stay for this long I mean I know y'all miss me and everything but I know y'all got other things to do I ain't you know I ain't selfish I don't want, I don't want to take all y'all time so I'm gonna do this little last cluster and I'm gonna do that corn and I'm gonna get about y'all way is that okay with y'all until next time, and I promise you it won't be forever. I just had to let y'all know. 14 days after, I'm good. And I love y'all. <laughs> 14 days after traveling during the pandemic. <clears throat> and I'm good. And the only two people that I've come in contact with is my mama and my weed man. Uh, 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 <laughs> I mean, I think that's good. <laughs> mm. Judge your mama, not me. I'm just playing. I just want y'all to have a good time out here. I want y'all to live, be great, smile, eat good, drink good, good, all that. <laughs> Do it. I'm telling you. Do it. That's what life is for. I don't think people really get to enjoy themselves like that because, you know, people are too busy worrying and being concerned about certain things. But when you realize that all you have to do is put your faith, faith and trust in him, <clears throat> yeah. Ugh. And Lord, I'm putting my faith in you that you get me through this. Thank you. Thank you. Yeah. Yeah. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you. Mm hmm. Mm -hmm. 
I mean, I mean, No! I'm dropping now. Yeah, as long as I'm done with this video, I'm going to run to my washing machine to throw this shirt up in there. I love this shirt. Can you have her stained up permanently? It's almost like you can get lost in it if you allow yourself to. Or am I the only one? Because I completely, I just space out. I space out. When I'm eating seafood, yeah. Because this is an experience. I don't know that it's become popular recently because of, you know, the mukbang. Mukbang has shot up them prices, them sales for the dang old seafood, baby. They welcome. <laughs> they welcome. Y'all welcome. I ain't even a fool, but I know I got to go, y'all. Let me get this coin. I'm gonna about y'all way. Okay, I'm gonna say this uh these crabs for a little bit later, maybe for a little snacky snack. Watch closely, because I know a lot of y'all be asking me, how did you do that? I want to learn. Watch closely, okay? And it's all about the the, the breathing. You breathe in. <laughs> I'm just playing, y'all. It's not that technical. I don't know. I just eat corn this way. It's always been, like, very satisfying to me to eat it this way, so I've always done it like that. So... The beats are sweet. Tastes good tonight. Yeah. Okay, you guys. This was amazing. I hope that you guys enjoyed this as much as I did. I will be back very, very soon. Like, maybe tomorrow with another video. And I hope that you guys are looking forward to that as much as I am. Because I just don't want y'all to be thinking like, you know, I'm out here just doing whatever and I'm forgetting about y'all. No, because that don't never be the case. Baby, what's going on? You just want to be in the scene so bad. Girl.
If you're not following me on my social media, you can follow me on my Instagram at underscore fatbellyfella, underscore also Facebook at fatbellyfella. But in the meantime, you know what's about to happen, you know what's about to go down. Don't forget to subscribe, like, comment, hit that notification bell to be notified each and every single time I upload another video. And don't forget to share, share, share because sharing is caring. And I will see you guys in the next video. Because we like this. Peace.